Is it bad that my mom looks like Louie She looks exactly like Louie Literally, as soon as you t- told me that, I thought of baskets right you away. Your dad was desperate for a fucking piece. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, that's fucking. Yeah, you just told me to be nice to him 30 minutes ago, and now we're breaking down his existence to just a green card. You're a fucking green card, baby. Dude. That green card so goddamn bad. <laughs> What did you just... <laughs> Apothecaries, bro. <laughs> you know LSU, their, uh, their coach... Is that today. not what the word is? <laughs> what are you even... What sentence... Apothecaries, you... nigga. <laughs> Apothecaries. <laughs> <laughs> he said apocatries or something. Alpacatries? Apocatries. You know, Apoc- what the fuck? You know what I'm talking about. Fucking al- alpacatries. <laughs> the apocatries, nigga. <laughs> Yeah, man, you, I got Jeff I, is a walking ad for why you people should quit drinking. <laughs> he was drunk when I picked him up. I got with the alchemist, and uh, we went to the you apothecaries. <laughs> and uh, he, to, he told me about my apothecaries, man. You, you sound like Mike Tyson trying to say, I pocket carry. <laughs> I put the apothecaries. You, you carry a gun in your waistband? Nah, I pocket carry. <laughs> nah, I pocket apothecaries. You know the... Uh, the the apothecary, you know what I'm the talking about. The hypothesis, you know, you know the thing. <laughs> My <laughs> hypothesis. Like Biden, right now, you know the thing. Oh, wait. Come on, the Come pack on, of trees. Man, apothecary, man. Come on, man. What's the actual word? Is it is it a apothecary? Yes. So I can't say apothecaries. No. no. I mean, it's probably a word to some. I don't know. What I, mean, I mean, that's a that's a very hood way to say it. Could be like a Skyrim character. Yeah, man, my Skyrim dude, man, he went to the apothecaries. You know what I'm saying? He... Oh, man, I was playing as a fucking cat. This game is dope as fuck. I got to the apothecaries, <laughs> and I grabbed myself a fucking potion that fixed my shit up. So it's not apothecaries. No, that it is. That I is don't know it. how many times we got to keep is explaining it, it to you, carries? but it's not. Apothecary. Apothec <laughs> Jim Carries, nigga. <laughs> this is going to be very interesting. We're going to have to I apothecary had a... your ass home. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody better fucking apothecary me home. <laughs> the name of this episode is going to be Apocatries, uh, for sure. Apocatries. <laughs> Pocket trees. I was supposed to be doing a sound test right now. I don't even know if this is recording properly, right. but I don't want to lose this. <laughs> no, I'm good. I'm here. <laughs> We're going to take a, a short break just to make sure that this fucking recorded properly. Apocatries. Apocatries. Government warning. If by how you fucked up the last read word, the label, I don't know if you're reading label is a good thing. Government warning. One, according to the Surgeon General, women should not drink alcoholic beverages during pregnancies because of the risk of birth de- defects. <laughs> Consumptions of alcoholic beverages impairs your ability to drive a car or operate machinery or apothecaries. Birth defects, example A. <laughs> he said consumptions. It may cause repairs your ability. Repairs your it may ability. Cause repairs. <laughs> oh, you're so stupid. To drive a car. <laughs> it repairs your ability to drive a car. It does the complete opposite, Jeff. <laughs> or, or, it really retards or you op- your ability to drive the car. <laughs> or you can operate machineries <laughs> and may cause health problems. All right. We purchased this at the local. Now you could deal. You could deal with your health. You could deal with your health by buying local uh, vines and bushes at the local apothecaries. Oh my god! You get like bushes and like health. Yeah. Right. Have you been to Hawking Hills? Have you seen the I local play- vagina that's there? The little waterfall vagina. Is that what this is? Like a I mean, Hawking look Hills? at it. Tell me that doesn't look like a fucking vagina. What's the percentage on that? Oh, looks like some shit. You yeah, fucking it's a fucking it's she, a spirit. Yeah, it's it's not much. It's not. <laughs> it's not moonshine. Store bought shit. So Granny Apple Mountain moonshine. 
It's safe to say I couldn't purchase that in local apothecaries. I don't know where this podcast is going to go. I don't know. I, no, wait. Honestly. Okay, I play, I play Skyrim. I love the fact that it started off with I love how you put a little glass off for me. Though. I play Skyrim. Like yeah, I forgot. It's okay. No, it makes, you know, I'm, I have control over. I play Skyrim. and like, I'm good, bro. I'm good. I'm good. good. I'm good. Yeah, can you the I play Skyrim, or? and when you go to, like, do alchemy, you go to the apothecaries, right? And you, uh, I don't know. What's up? What we do? I'm a full metal alchemist. You know what I'm talking about. Yeah, I'm a full metal Alchemist Brotherhood. Uh, I'm an Afro Samurai. I, uh, I, Anyways, when I Afro visit my Samurai Jack, he's just going to start mixing Before shit Before we together. let Jeff just go on his tangent of retardedness, um, welcome to the Jerk Off Guys podcast. We can't say Jerk That's the name of No, your we can pod- call it. The, it's still Jug. Like, we're still, that's still the joke. It's just uh, there was so when, already which a pod- J- it was already a JOG podcast up. Which so, one is it on? Is it on JOG <laughs> or are we jerk offs or what it's, are we did? It's, it's the same thing. On right? audio. This is my first time here. Yeah. No, on on audio, it's it's the Jerk Off Guys podcast. Available on all platforms. But isn't this like a video too? Yeah, it's both. It so what is it both. on video? On audio it's, it's on jerk-offs. YouTube. It's on my YouTube channel for the original podcast, Den of Debauchery. YouTube dot com slash Den of Debauchery. So on audio we're jerk offs, but on video we're, we're debauchers. Still it's still, it's still uh, jog. It's still I'll let jog. You take it's the just on, on that one. fucking. You know what? I'm not gonna explain it to him. He's too drunk. All right? He'll I'm forget. not that drunk. Let's go back to a pocket, oh. a pocket trees, please. Yeah, go a pack of trees. Um, go back to my pocket trees, also known as a forest. No, if a pocket trees, yeah, it's a forest. If I need an alchemist. And I needed like a health cure. I'd go to my pocket trees, right? Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Sure. Sure. So it's a it's a it's an alpaca trees. Yeah, the alpaca trees. Yeah. Alpacas in the trees. Yeah. 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 It's Absolutely. A, it's a Swedish thing, but you know. <laughs> alpacas are Swedish. Yep. So are blonde. Bitches. Alpacas are sweet. What are you talking about? I don't know. What is he talking about? I'm just gonna say stupid know. shit. I don't know what's going no, on. No, my my. Uh, I guess it would be second cousin. Uh, who's a teacher at my school? He raises alpacas. Is he weird? He raises. No, he's incredibly intelligent. Does he have trees? I remember him being bummed out that I hated science when I was going through his class because he was like all excited. He's like, "Ah, oh, yeah, a relative. I think he's gonna look, dig science." And I just hated it, and I was super lazy, and I just—he was so sad. Did he, he have trees? That motherfucker can drink. How, wait, wait. He was your teacher in middle school? Uh, high school. Oh, that's not that kind of dope. Yeah, I'd see, I'd see him very rarely at family functions because it's kind of distant. But when I did see him, man, that motherfucker could put down some beer. Did he have trees by <laughs> which he raises these alpacas? The How long were you sitting trees? on that joke, Jeff? How long I was, you was waiting for you to stop talking. <laughs> this other I was jokes that he wrote five talking. years ago, probably. <laughs> This is but all part of an elaborate plan of Jeff. He knew what he was saying when shit. he first fucked up the From word. From YouTube? From YouTube? I'm a fucking actor. Have you guys... Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Let's talk Are about you that. Are so, uh, you guys actors or... Yeah, we're in the same yeah, film comedians. as you, actually. <laughs> yeah. I think we're actually technically yeah. active. You we're, guys are just comedians. Though. We actually were the funny people in your fucking movie. Yeah. <laughs> like, well, yeah. Yeah, we're... we're like, the, I wasn't funny. We compare to you as, like, this is what funny looks like, and this is how bad We were actually sucks. what you wanted to be in the movie. That's hilarious, yes. actually. Yeah. So, because I was doing things with my life and made, mm-hmm. like, a movie and, like, got you guys to tag along. No, it was not you at think, all. It was not you. It was it had something to do with you guys. Yeah, yeah. You guys took your alpacas and you went to the alpaca trees and you thought like because. Wait a minute, hold on. You oh, guys God. did do the only stand up in the movie. Okay, that was good. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Man, I'm glad it came full circle, Jeff. Jeff Whatever, but I'm Jeff, gonna ask now. I'm gonna mean this is a serious question. What? You okay, bud? No. <laughs> okay. No. Yeah. I need some help. Yeah. Can you help me? With what? Probably not, but we're going to try. Um, he, uh, w- do you I mean, know I'm what not a-, a teacher. I'm not a therapist. Like, I can't help you with anything that you struggle with in life. What's yeah. going on? Buddy? Yeah, do you know where to find some acid? N- no. My acid guy cut me off, so. So that's what? He cut you off? I've never yeah, heard that did, happening. I did too much. Then like, he's done. I believe he's that. done with me. Yeah, call the cops. Like, he's like call the cops on yourself a couple times. Eventually, people are going to be like, "Hey, yeah, no he's more pretty problems. much." He's like, "Dude, can you tell that story?" Because it's a it's a fucking great story. I took three hits of acid, mm-hmm. 
and I figured out how to eat shrooms until the acid kicked in. Oh, that's smart, yeah. That took about 40, 50 minutes. Six grams of shrooms later, I'm tripping harder than I ever tripped in my life. I called 911 on myself. I thought now, I was... Now, you called 911 because you thought you were dying? I thought I was dying. Okay. I went to wash my face. I looked in the mirror. I was bleeding out my nose, like bleeding uncontrollably all over my clothes, all over my shirt, all over the floor. You know, what do I do? What do I do? I'm bleeding. I don't want to die. What am I dying? I'm dying. Call Did you do coke that day? No. Just Dang. acid and shrimps. Oh, Dang. the fun. Tell them about the part about the not even being blood. Call 911. When I call 911, what's your emergency? Yeah, I'm bleeding out my nose and I think I'm dying. They're like, they asked me like, well, what do you mean? Like, what happened? What do you mean you think you're dying? I told him like, I took acid and I think I'm dying. And you can hear like telling some dude in the background like, he said he took acid. And then like, like we'll be right there. And like I, they get off the phone and I walk outside immediately like they're going to be there in like two seconds. Like, where are they? <laughs> you know? And I go right back inside and then I realize there was no blood. I was never bleeding. It was just a hallucination. I hallu- Yeah, I hallucinated me bleeding on my nose, dying, whatever. And then all of a sudden, when the cops show up from calling 911, I all of a sudden think they're there to shoot me in the face. Oh, shit. Like, I think, like, they're out there. The acid I sold, my friends killed them. My friends are dead. My homie Jay Spade's a cop. I feel like they're, they're there to, like, for some reason, like, I can't open my door. The evil men are out there to shoot me in the head. And, like, really, like, you can hear them outside, like, come on, Jeffrey. Just open the door. You know? And I'm, I'm on the phone with my homie Jay Spade the whole time. And he's like, Jeff, you're good. Like, just. Why are you talking to him? He's a fucking cop, man. You can't trust that son of a bitch. I thought he was a cop. I called him. <laughs> I thought I was dying, dude. Did you tried... call him and accuse him of being a cop? No, no, no. <laughs> later, later, yeah. But, <laughs> dude, I tried to call my mom that night. Thank God my mom didn't answer. Thank God, dude. Can that you imagine? Terrible. Mom, I took acid and I'm How dying. How do I explain that? I'm dying, mom. Oh, she, uh, does she know anything about me. acid? She has no idea. Because she, she would think that you're actually dying, I'm sure. Absolutely, because that's what I was calling to tell her. Hey, Bob, oh, oh, the cops are here My to kill me. I'm over. dying. My life is over. Come I was, save me, mother. That story is so like, sad. Dude, I thought like my shit was done for. Damn. Look, okay, but nothing happened because... Yeah, he's better now, see? Because <laughs> you good. didn't let him in. You, the cops. I didn't never... open the door. They were adamant. I was like, is anybody in there with you? Anybody in there with you, Jeffrey? You know, they were trying to, I'm, I'm, I'm like, you know what I'm saying? They left. They were there for like two hours, then they left. But I was like watching out my window the whole time thinking they are going to come back. That's interesting because they, apparently they can't just go in. They couldn't. That's like, interesting. Like they didn't. They I, were I, right I, outside of my door. I literally thought they were going to like bust in yeah. my door and like shoot me. Because I would head. think legally they'd have enough reason to believe that you're in danger. I and they told them I was on, to I, was, I told them I was on acid. Right. What what happened? What do you mean you're dying? I took acid, and I think I'm dying, is what I said. And they still because I did, so when because they I didn't up, let them in the door, they they did nothing. So they what, showed up with the fire truck, the ambulance, everybody. Damn, spotlights. dude! All because of dudes on acid. Oh, absolutely! They a fire truck, fire truck, ambulance, cop cars. Spotlight on my fucking door, on Jay my Spade. window. Jay Spade. Jay Spade parked down the street. Jay Spade was out there in his street clothes and on a police the vest. Was he on a bullhorn? Snitching and shit. You know, <laughs> that motherfucking fucking turn Jeffrey, me in. Nigga. Jeffrey, we all care about you. Please step out. I was tripping, though. Like, I thought, like, Jay Spade was a cop. Like, I thought I saw him down there with the cops. Turns out he never got out of his car. He parked down the street. Because when he got there from... He saw all the cops. He was like, oh, fuck He this. parked down the street. I'm a, yeah. I'm going to keep a little he distance. Never, he never got out of his oh, car. Just, just imagine there's an officer named Jay Spade. But yeah. I thought... Officer Jay Spade. He just got by. There just has to be an officer <coughs> with the last name Spade walking by. But dude, it's just me, like... <gasps> dun, 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 it's a white guy, though, but you're an ass. tripping. I, I saw him down there with, like, the cops. Like, why you going to do <clears> me like this, Spade? <clears throat> How you going to do me like this, Jay Spade? <laughs> Oh my never so even... what? So what changed like after the call to make you think like no nobody can come in this motherfucker? You thought you thought they were all there to kill you. When I realized it... I wasn't bleeding, 
I was like, oh shit. I'm just tripping. I'm tripping. That was So then you real... don't want to let him in because you don't want to get in trouble? It just like my whole my whole thinking switch. I'm, I'm not dying. dying. I'm not dying. I'm not dying. I, I, so I don't want these cops ain't... in here. I know I'm not I dying, so cops. nobody's coming in here anymore. I called him. I called him here. Yeah. I thought I was dying. Oh shit, I'm not dying. What are these all these cops doing outside of my house? Shit, dude. And how long did it take you to you did acid again? A week. Jesus. <laughs> Jesus. There's no way I'd ever touch the shit again, man. I got no some. You guys want some acid? No. No. no I, after that, no, I'm good, no. man. I Just don't. take like two hits. You'll be good. No, I don't think that <laughs> calling the cops on myself sounds like a fun time. Have no. you ever? Have you ever? Have you ever gone outside of your own thinking? Have you ever opened your brain to the point where it's like? No, nah, dude. I've, you you never you listen, never viewed the world like this before. No, if I stepped out of my own way of thinking, I wouldn't be racist. Have you anymore. ever thought you were dying in the next like three seconds? This oh, does yeah. not sound fun, Jeff. Yeah. yeah, you're not really selling it. That's yeah. kind of what happened. I called the that I night. called the cops on myself. I hallucinated that I was bleeding out of my face. I thought I was dying. Have you ever like every three seconds been like, oh shit, this is it? I'm going to die. Yeah, you I ever think that your best friend sound is a like cop? Fun to me. That's a bad trip though. Like a good trip is like you figured the world out. You it's have like, like hey, this have huge you ever idea. been kicking the balls mentally for eight hours straight? Try acid. Fuck that. It sounds awful. Oh, and shrooms. On top of that, that's just I. A I would be down thing. to microdose shrooms because I hear good things about that. Everything else other than Shit's weed, soft, dude. Eat an eighth. No, could be in a pussy. No, microdose. I'm gonna put that on his gravestone. <laughs> Shit is soft. Quit being. You a want pussy. me to just be a hardcore Eat addict an like you and just like? I mean, microdose. <laughs> yeah. Well, what do you wanna? What are you gonna eat? Some tea and crumpets, and you know what I'm saying? Microdose. Yeah. Explain what, 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 you, what, you, what do you bitch man? It's, it's just you, a very you'll limited amount three, of mushrooms. You'll Apparently. eat point three of mushrooms, and then you'll mm-hmm. wait an hour, and then you'll mm-hmm. eat another point three of mushrooms. You're not gonna trip. It it might almost give you a body buzz. You're not really gonna get high. You're gonna almost get high off of shrooms, but you won't because you don't eat enough. It's only a microdose. It's a small amount that you eat like every fucking like hour or so. You won't trip. You won't get high. You a lot won't of people a- say that it, like it's like great for like writing doesn't and do enjoying shit. like music, but it doesn't like fuck you up. Oh, like you can go to the grocery store. Yeah. Oh, that's amazing. That's most microdose. people, most yeah, people who like, microdose, it, sound, it sounds good. You but. know, most people who microdose like have taken enough shrooms to trip before. You yeah. know, you you understand the feeling of tripping. You'll, you know, what I mean, like if you don't take enough to trip, I'm not, I'm not gonna there's do. There's really no. I'm point. not gonna do like full shrooms. I'm only gonna do like diet shrooms, shrooms light. I'm saying like if you don't if zero you don't, calorie shrooms. If you don't take enough to trip, then there's really no point. Like you, you're really like just kind of wasting your time. You're kind of like jerking off without fucking busting a nut. You know what I mean? Sometimes edging. You I mean, might as well, right. listen. You might as well just eat the eighth of shrooms. I'll be honest. That analogy was fine. way more coherent than I expected. <laughs> acid. There's there's never been a oh there's never been an OD recorded off of acid. There's been people who fucking take forty hits of acid. Yeah, there's been people that fucking jump out of a fucking third story window because they believe they can fly. There's been people like me that call nine one one. Yeah, they they try to drive a car and they run it into a tree. Still, trying to convince me that acid is safe. But still, there's there's no there's no recorded fucking. This guy, uh, this guy, OD. John Lennon was actually on acid when he was shot. Exactly. But he died. Still think it's safe. He was still (laughs) think again. Think again. Say Acid no. is actually safer than shrooms in that respect. I mean, there's. You've not sold us on this at all. Yeah, I don't. I'm not. It doesn't with you. sound safe. I'm not with you at all. You, bro. Do you, have you ever heard of like third eye vision or looking lucid? Or how about how about lucid dreaming? Have you ever dreamed and felt like your dream was? What like a like a, you you felt like you were seeing something. That was like groundbreaking. Like you, like you, it's like a, it's like a mental breakthrough. You will go outside of your head. It's like an outer body experience. You're, I fucking taken an acid. outer body experience. I've taken You're acid like a, and fucking looked at myself 
sleeping on like my parents' bed. Like I had like an out of body experience. It's a terror. You're like a shitty car salesman. You're like this is great gas mileage, but it might spontaneously blow up on the road. <laughs> like it doesn't. I, it's terrible. Oh, I don't no, no, no. You guys are you guys are gonna love this car. It only comes with three wheels. Uh, but it's 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 really solid. You'll get pulled over constantly. Yeah, there's a big leak in the gas tank. You're gonna get it a big a big fast. rack and get really hurt for driving. It, it also has no airbags, but it's so much fun. Yeah. Uh, yeah, there's technically no windshield, but that's what's great. It's like you feel the wind blowing through your hair. It's refreshing in the winter time. It keeps you awake and alert on the road. It doesn't go over 20 miles per hour. <laughs> like it's, you've not sold us on these drugs. Jeff. Okay, if you if you want to microdose um, mushrooms. You want to microdose mushrooms? There's you can you can there's been cases of people you can OD on mushrooms. Mushrooms can make you go crazy. But I haven't heard of anybody going crazy on acid except for like what like fucking uh, you yeah when you thought you were bleeding out the nose yeah no 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 all right no no, no, no. no that didn't happen anymore Ozzy Osbourne or somebody like that mm-hmm. fucking Grateful Dead motherfuckers yeah his there's bra- no his brain is melted. Yeah, he sounds like a boxer when he talks, like an old uh, boxer. Uh, uh, Sharon! Uh, Sharon! Uh, this is a fucking cunt. Sharon! 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 You, you, you smoke weed, right? You're a fucking asshole. Yeah, fucking Chipotle Maria and the fucking assholes. <laughs> but you, you smoke weed, right? You're all a bunch of assholes. You but smoke weed, right? You smoke weed a little bit sometimes? Yeah. You. I mean, you're doing worse just smoking weed than microdosing the mushroom. The microdose of the mushrooms is like point three. You're not gonna trip. You don't know what tripping is. Like it's like yeah. you'll never know <laughs> until you do it. You know what I mean? Like it, everybody's brain is different. It, it has a lot to do with like what you're feeling at the time when you take the drug. Yeah, it, here's the thing with like tripping on mushrooms or acid. It's too long. It's too long of a commitment. Mushrooms I, is less like, than acid. Um, because if I don't like it, then I'm stuck in that for like eight hours or more. I'm just stuck in it. Misconception. That fucking sucks, and I don't want to Mushrooms is stronger, but it's less than acid. Acid, if you take two hits of acid, yeah, you'll be tripping for like eight hours. What about a... If you fucking eat an eighth of mushrooms, you'll only be tripping for like an hour or two. What about maybe. taking mushrooms and watching all the Blade movies? You'd fi- probably have a fucking great night. And then you'd be like, yeah, Jeff was right. We should take hallucinogens. That and- first Blade movie was fucking... Uh, I, 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 the opening scene is my favorite of all time. I, I, I'm an I, actor now, so... I couldn't even list... Well, let's pull back. It might be triple digits the number of times I've seen the first Blade. At least in no, part. Easily, easily. TV, I've seen it at least 15 times. It's a classic. That's a classic Triple digits? Cool I say It might be. Like, if you, if you count, like, seeing part of it, like, when it gets showed on, like, TNT and shit... Enough cable. Back in the I always like I've the first. Van, like I always like the first vampire times. that got like burnt to a crisp, and they still woke yeah. up and like jumped out of the fucking hospital. You know what always got window. me about that is that he knew that he didn't t- kill that guy, so he just allowed them to like take him into the hospital, knowing that he was gonna come out and probably bite somebody. This is gonna. He's an irresponsible piece of shit. I he bit the fuck gotta... out of that chick, the, the chick that was in the story the whole time. Yeah, he almost ended up with a new vampire. Listen, I'm gonna ruin the movie for you guys. Do you remember when he pins him to the wall in the dance club? Mm-hmm. He shot him with silver, and he killed him with silver at the end from his his glasses. Yeah, it was it was strange because every vampire gets killed from those silver stakes, but yeah, he no. didn't die. No, there's a there's a lot. My only thought is that, uh, for whatever reason, I- I'm guessing. So, Blade, you know, is a comic book movie. I'm guessing that that character is like a vampire it, is, is a unique type of vampire. Where yeah, like, he's like it, a goose. He's, 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 like, he's like you know. I thought I might try like silver this time. I was like, I might try like burning you this time since it seems so hard to kill you. Yeah, I think fair. he did uh, say it's hard. You're I'm getting guessing. harder to kill. Yeah, he did say that. I'm guessing that there's probably a deleted scene on the cutting room floor that is just like I'm gonna be honest him with talking you guys. to Whistler and be like, yeah, I still haven't figured out how to Whistler. kill that piece of shit. You know, I I jerked off to a scene in that movie. I'm not very proud of um, the opening scene. The black chick. With the opening scene when they're in the club and oh, the guy's getting his dick sucked. Oh, yeah. And I was like, you uh, jerked off to yeah, that? Yeah, I did, man. I Dude, like, what do you mean? <laughs> yeah, like, yeah. What do you mean? A scene in a movie where somebody's simulating sex? Yeah, anything like that. Why of course no? I'd be jerking. Yeah, I was jerking. It's I before, paused it. It's before off. the blood orgy. 
Yeah, it's before it's the, the blood orgy. So you, you might have almost crossed that line. I would rather orgy. jerk it to the blood orgy. Listen, was... did I finish before the blood orgy? No. no. I paused it every time. I'll be like, man, he's going to stay. And I'd rewind it. Be, be, it's only like a four second scene. But you just like watching the dude getting topped off. At, at the age of 12? Yeah, it's the only access I had to porn. What's like the g- grossest thing you've jerked off to? Oh, do you want to know? I do want to know. I'm very curious. Have you ever seen midget porn? That's not the. That's the I grossest. Don't think that's gross. It's funny. Is it hot? There's some really hot midgets. What about granny porn? Not that bad either. Ooh. There's some hot granny. Like There's super, some hot granny. super old. Like old, 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 old. Why did you jerk off to that? Like fucking eighty like, years old. Like eighty? Why not? <laughs> because if you, because <laughs> if you answer. have to go out and search that, there's other things you could have searched for. That's so, why. So you never seen like a. Not old. Golden Girls. Not old to that like level. Like Golden Girls chick fucking get rammed. I can't go older than like 50s. I can't go I older than like 50s. I want to know what makes a woman I'm in not, their 80s feel, be like, them. I want to get fucked now on camera. I mean, old women are still horny as shit. Like, everybody's still horny. But that's just weird. I feel but like at that age, it's like, like I'm responsible. Porno I'm not, level, well, get fucked step on one, camera. Have a dad that molested you or died. That's that's step But then if you're one. 80, it was so long. Ago. You were like, what are you sexually mistreated like, some way. Over it. You were sexually mistreated some way. Or you, wouldn't be doing be, you wouldn't be doing this. They probably worked in Hollywood in like the fucking 40s and 50s and were just getting fucking triple teamed just to be an extra and gone with the wind. <laughs> but 80 year old get a movie whores? part? <laughs> What did you do to get your thing, you yeah, fucking see? whore? What do you mean? I'm a fucking hilarious If you want to be a background actor in the back of this scene when you're walking down the sidewalk, you're going to have to suck all of our dicks. <laughs> you want Matter of fact, get... you're a woman. Just do it. Huh? Come on, toots. Ha! Huh, you want to get it in this movie? <laughs> Looks like you're going to have to give us all the Oops, fucking I'm sorry. You're around. just going to be working nah. out. I lied. Your craft services today. Ha <laughs> ha. Joke's on you. Is that how you had to get into the movie? It was Eric Boso. I was like, Jeff, if you want to get out if of you put movie, your dick, if you put your dick, you're going to have to suck my dick. He was like, oh, if you put your dick to my weird fucking little uh, cancer vein thing on my arm, then... <laughs> 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 Jesus Christ. <laughs> yeah, that's how it happened. No, did you give him... Did you promise him a kidney? <laughs> now I want you to finger the hole, Jeffrey. No, I, pro- I promise him. I promise him some jokes that would be funny. You? On stage. Some yeah, I promised him. I lied to his ass. Yeah. <laughs> no. Is that why he wrote yeah, in I'm all gonna, his yeah, jokes? I'm gonna come up with the good jokes. So, so you're in the movie with us. You told him and, like, um, with, have, you, yeah, with, with you, with you guys. Us. Yeah, we uh, were in okay. the movie. So yeah. tell me the whole premise of this movie without ruining it for the viewers. Okay, um, basically it's an actor turned comedian that wants to do comedy and he sucks. So Jeremy he, Piven. So Jeff Adala. He. Um, <laughs> but he you weren't fi- an actor first. He finds a um he acts like a, a secret ingredient, and when he drinks this secret ingredient, that, it makes his comedy so good <laughs> that it literally kills crowds. Like they laugh so hard they die. Ooh. And like I he, assume it's he a short literally film? kills. Yeah. This is a short film. I actually came up with the story. So I got writing credits. I'm an actor. Um a hot You chick came up with the story? Me and Sam came up with the story. Straight Sam up. who? The girl. Sam Somebody Martin, did. the chick that played my girlfriend. The oh, okay. The hot blonde chick. I don't, that kissed I don't, me. I don't really know her. I, I, she kissed I, me. I've met her once, but I've, I don't think. Oh, I've, I've met, met her talking. more than once. No, she's a sweet person. She's very uh, nice. She's she's really okay. cool. She's yeah, a really yeah. cool person. Nice. And she's all jocking me and, and she so kissing me it, and shit. You know, because you wrote it in the script. Something tells me that that's that, I didn't that write is that. the most action you've had in like months. Months. You think is that, so? Is that fair? That's not true. No, he just fucked some girl. Yeah, the fucking told me about that. Yeah. Oh nice! Yeah, yeah, Good for you, buddy. She was she was cheap too. Like she's very cheap. Hat, a half Japanese chick came to town. Yeah, she's whenever she decides to come back to Ohio, I stroke it. Yeah, she's an escort. Nice. Yeah. Oh, it's she's an not, escort. She's not an yeah. escort. No, no, she was she was one of those. She was in town half not. off. <laughs> sucky, sucky, half off. No, she's not an escort. She's a massage. We're actually therapist. married to she's each other. She's a traveling masseuse. She's married. We're married to each other, so she can have her American visa. But that's. <laughs> Don't stop touching my leg. What are you doing? Whatever, man. God, you actors. Come on, are... man. So, like, dude, come on. Are you going to be doing any other movies? Yeah. Of course. What's, was, what's uh, next in the works for Jeff Ladala? Roots Two. I've actually been. <laughs> <laughs> I've been Roots a, to I've a pack been, of trees. I've been approached. I've been approached for, 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 
for roots to the dawn of the yes. apothecaries. They're gonna they're using his body as a, one of the slave ships <laughs> that they transport people on. They were looking they were, they were looking at me for a Rambo reboot, you know. Uh, <laughs> Kindergarten Cop Three, they, uh, um, you know, I just, I just got all these Hambo. Hambo. <laughs> I try, I try to sing I his throat, but the knife wouldn't go up, through you know? the fucking throat. <laughs> I just really wish I went and did yeah. the movie because now like everything's just exploding for me. You know? Yeah, that's why you needed me to pick you so. up at a fucking <laughs> shitty bar tonight, yeah. including your heart. You saved me. You saved me from them groupies. We're, the men that were all on the patio yeah, with you? all those oh, dudes. Yeah, yeah. All those dudes. No, Jeff don't like men's no more. He likes women's. Women's, women's, women's. So are you going to like, are you leaving comedy now to pursue? Are you going to be, are you going to be re- reuniting with Lucas? Well, who would I be if I left comedy? Jeff Liddell. Yeah, I mean, were you really ever in it? Realistic? <laughs> Was I really ever yeah. there? What do you mean, man? Yeah, I mean, you... look. <laughs> you should have. I just go wherever my uh, <laughs> where my car wherever, wherever, wherever my car I goes. I just go wherever Allah takes me. I go wherever, <laughs> wherever your friend with a car is. That's where you go. Yes. I just go wherever my friend with the car takes me. You know. So what's in, what movie? Do you, so seriously, are you doing anything else, Abasso? Um. No, I mean he might be doing a bar mitzvah or something, and I can mm-hmm. go up there. and Probably get like five minutes or something, you know. Tell some jokes. That's extremely racist. That's a you really can joke oh, I, like that. That just sounds like you slowing down. You don't do comedy voice. Well, yeah, I do comedy. <laughs> I can't. I'm gonna work on Basso tonight. You do a really good Basso. I got. I got a few solid ones. It scares me how easy because you lack oh, so much you make fun emotion, of true real again. but you can adapt to any person. It scares <laughs> me. Like I don't think you're a human. You think I'm I think you're a... just still studying for when the mothership comes on how to like hey, yeah, adapt why, to people. Why don't you make fun of true real again? That was good. Oh my god, I'm, hey, I'm he was sure, not sure. having that. Man. True real he scares lo- me. He's he a scary that. dude. Is he so, it was so is funny because like I I remember talking to somebody about it and they're like, "Are you worried?" And I was like, "I will." I mean, I will fuck that dude up if he tries something. And I was like, uh, I don't think real. it should come to that. I thought you know, I was trying to have a little fun with him. It shouldn't be a big deal, but no. He, well, I got to say, there's it. so many comics in the scene that get so easily offended, and it's so funny. But I didn't think you'd be one of them. No, I didn't either. Yeah, I mean, that's and a, that's the thing. Like When I, I brought it up, I wasn't necessarily going to joke with him. I brought up the lottery tickets, and then he held them up, which to me was kind of given like, a little bit of clue of like, mm-hmm. yeah, he'll enjoy this joke. Cool. He, won't, he won't take it too hard. Here's the tip. Because if it looked joke? like he, I would just said, uh, I did like an actual true real style joke. I was like, he writes his jokes on a lot of tickets. I was like, it's the most ghetto shit I've ever heard. And then I did like a true real style like rhyming joke about. It's like, it's like I write my jokes on a lotto ticket. It's like buy like a, a motherfucker. Buy man. a big bottle and sip it. Um. I go to the court, dribble, then swish it, and if there's a girl with a big nipple, I flick it. That's a true old, that sounds like a true old yeah. joke. Maybe he was mad. I can't you were, believe I just remember that whole thing. Maybe I, that was, was like almost two years ago. Maybe he was mad that you were it like stealing girl. black culture. Maybe that's what that, I don't know. Hey, but here's the, the thing. I got a big I laugh off it. that. I got a big laugh on that, and then I bombed the rest of my set. And then when he goes up there, and he, he goes, he's like, don't worry about my shit being ghetto. You need to worry about your own shit. And I laughed because I had a bad set. And I knew he's fucking with me back. I was like, ah, oh, yeah, that was bad. And then he's like, don't fuck with anybody. Don't fuck him with you because I'm not the there. fucking one. And I was just like, oh, shit, he's ready to fight. Don't fuck with me. I'll, 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 fuck, my, I'll, I'll fuck you up, white boy. You are going to be the next true real in Columbus Comedy in like 10 years, <laughs> actually. I'm gonna be homeless. <laughs> yeah, yeah, basically. <laughs> what do you? <laughs> yeah, you're gonna be homeless, riding on lotto tickets that you never even filled out, and I'm gonna be mad. Will I, people I make my jokes it, like, better? It blows me away that I see him writing because he does the same set every time. He does. Ran out of. I don't want to get in trouble. Never mind. Never mind. What? He's a good. I'm not saying his jokes. Does he, you think he has? Oh, yeah, do you think he has t- internet? He's totally gonna listen say? to this. I don't Ran out of gas home. like a motherfucker. I don't think man. he has a computer or a phone. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't have a phone. No. He's like, I'm going to sell a back a... gorilla dick and, and some squirrel nuts. And my girl got an orangutan pussy. And I. Uh, <laughs> I got a big silver back gorilla dick with some squirrel nuts. Yeah. <laughs> and my girl got an orangutan pussy. 
I didn't put gas in my car like a motherfucker. I ran out of gas like, like a, a motherfucker. motherfucker. Someone stole my car like, like a, a motherfucker, motherfucker, but he didn't get far because he didn't have no gas. I'm a smart mototherfucker. Something like that. That shit made my ass seem smart like a motherfucker. That shit made my ass seem Man. smart like a motherfucker. Yeah, pretty much everybody in Columbus Comedy can do his entire set because he never changes it. <laughs> nah, he's just always writing. Uh, yeah. I think I don't know what he writes on there. Maybe like just numbers? I don't I know. Like, I feel like True Real did like two songs back in the day, and that's what he's like. He just he has a bit where he's just singing the word food stamps like over and over again. It sounds like he did like songs though. Like <laughs> you were the fattest movie. guest we've ever had because you leaned <laughs> back and moved the closet door. I've never <laughs> he seen that. He leaned back and just opening like, and closing the closet. Oh my god, I've never <laughs> seen that. If you're listening to this, on we audio, had big built go to Lappy. fucking YouTube right now. Oh my god, Jeff, that chair is that chair gonna be okay? <laughs> Tom, what are you guys talking about? <laughs> just fucking chilling. You guys are fucking. See, oh, my friend yeah. told me not to do this. What friend told you not to? He moved and he did it. The fucking white girl at the bar told me not to fucking do this. You guys are gonna be assholes. Oh my oh, god! Did she? What is this? What if a body fell out? <laughs> <laughs> it's just a hooker. I should do that as a fucking. Oh, that's a good idea. Oh, uh, just to fuck with somebody. That's a good time. idea. You oh, gotta make sure they're as fat as either. Jeff and don't lean back. <laughs> And just, just, a fuck, just no, a fuck you know what? Somebody. Not even like that, just a blow up doll, just like a sex doll. Oh, I make sure it's like wet and so oily. Fucking... Make sure it's wet and oily, covered it's in like all vegetable sticky. oil. It's just covered in. Oh, that'd be perfect. Jelly. That'd be hilarious. And lotion. Oh my god, that would be fantastic. It depends on which sex doll you're talking about. Like, should, talking that about might like... be that might be a decent skit actually. If we get the legs from the little dick you show, just the <laughs> weird ass <laughs> long legs. <laughs> legs just go on my shoulder like. So when, so are you gonna be able to? Are you like, uh, what's going on with you hosting, man? Are you gonna be able to host Drunken Head again? What's in the work? Like, what is up with? Uh, you fucking tell me. Am I? I don't know. He doesn't fucking run that shit. That's I don't know either. Did you ever like throw your hat in there to be I like a backup? Tr- I know Trish is a psycho. That's all I know. I don't know nothing about that. Oh, you don't. I'm not. I, no. You weren't that. You weren't there when we were shooting the movie, and she threw. You. you I told you I wasn't. Who, yeah, someone got thrown out there? after we left. Somehow we didn't get thrown out. Wait, who she threw and out? And then no, she threw all of us out. She's like, nah, I can't be here after twelve because I know Andreas wouldn't want us here after twelve. It's like, you can't be fucking pissed at her for fucking. My whole bar tab is a hundred dollars. Like that's not true, Trisha. My fucking shit is fucking, you know, sixty dollars just me. Like don't fucking your whole bar tab. That's cheap for you too. She threw she, out two people. No, she, um, it was, was she in the dude. movie? <coughs> she was in the movie. She, she got had shot three lines. Scene. She she butchered them. Oh, uh, there was a there was a time where like, I kept making her laugh. It was just, yeah. I uh, the lines I, weren't I, funny, but like me delivering funny, them made her laugh. Here's what's funny is that we were like sitting there like reading the script and we were just talking shit about it out loud, like just fucking around. And then I'm just like I'm seeing the people that are there to like work with Eric on the movie, and I was like. Oh man, these guys are gonna take this like seriously and be like, "Hey, all these guys are being super rude and talking shit about." Hey, you. Eric, <laughs> this is art, and they're over there shitting on. So it. like, <laughs> before we left, I said, "I was like, hey, by the way, we were talking mad shit. We were just fucking around. Don't, don't take it to heart." Well, now yeah. I don't feel bad that I found out. Now that I know that you and Sam wrote it, I feel fine about it. I thought no, Eric wrote we did, it. We yeah, didn't it write was it. dog <laughs> shit. We didn't it was write it. Fucking ass. We didn't write you it. Suck, Eric bro. also wrote the screenplay. Me and Sam came up with the. Uh, oh, it was actually brilliant. We came up with. The brilliant plot. Oh yeah, now that I didn't write it, it was genius. Yeah, it was brilliant. <laughs> no, honestly, it touched me. It touched me emotionally. Honestly, I was like, why? I, really, when I was acting, it, it, I was it, like, I'm gonna win an Emmy. It had more an impact Emmy? than any short an Emmy. film. The I've fact that he of. let us get on stage it felt like a privilege. As soon as yeah. I uttered the first, line, I'm honored. I knew I was changing my entire life. Right. What's the title of it? Uh, Knock him dead. Nightmare on Fifth Street or something? What is it? Knock him dead. Knock him dead. Mm-hmm. Mm. Oh, okay. Yeah. What does that do? That sounds like the name does that, of a, Does that untangle your little man bun there? Knock him no. Dead sounds like the name of like a sci-fi channel movie where <laughs> if, you, if, you, if somebody ding-dong ditches you and you answer the door, the demon comes in <laughs> and you die. Knock him Dead! <laughs> yeah. It, it took it, the budget was. Do you notice how I called it "ding dong ditching" instead of the other name? I know what you wanted. To say. <laughs> I was very proud of you. Actually, I was going to bring that up next. Like, you knew you're knocking. Uh, uh, you wanted to say. Wait till the podcast knocking. is over, and I just thought say, of the. 
of the secondary name for Roots 2. <laughs> you mean the nigger knockers? The nigger knockers! The nigger, nigger knocking? That would be a great horror film, The Nigger Knockers. <laughs> the Nigger Knockers. <laughs> the nigger knockers. It's like they. Uh, that sounds like a black. They just knock on people's doors. Big tits. And like knockers. if you answer that shit, like you die, like you're dead. You know what I mean? That'd be such a boring movie though. But they. It's There's no the action. It's like the door, you're dead, and then it's just like over. No, it's just because it takes them forever to figure out what's you, going on. If you're black and you answer, but they'd figure out once the cops go knock. Oh yeah, it, it has to be a nigger knock. Oh, now we're sounding like this is like a plot to like a like a Peel no. movie, like a Jordan Peel yeah, movie. Yeah. <laughs> and some, and, and somehow it solves racism at the end. I don't fucking know. It's a nigger and knock. It turns out that white people are still evil. <laughs> at the end. And the true evil was the white man. Don't be knocking on doors. I'm sure Jordan. This Jordan summer, Peele. dude, they I, thought they were trick or treating. I went into Get Out expecting not to like it. It's pretty. It's a, it's a brilliant movie. I haven't even seen the new one. Even, the other one he made was it Us or something? Or uh, Us was good. Us yeah. was good. I haven't seen that yet. Get Out was brilliant because you're Get just like, what great. the fuck is really going on? Like, you knew something was up, but they don't really tell you to that. You know what I mean? And you're just like, ah, uh, that makes kind My of, favorite part was just the black guy who's running around on the property. You they're all brainwashed. The, they're the all, groundskeeper, they're all... the black guy who was Oh, like, yeah, he's just he sprinting just in the sprint. middle of the night. Because he never... He all... never... It's just literally when he's sprinting at him, it just looks like he's running a fucking post route. He's a do 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 And he cuts super hard. You knew that was a guy who like was one of those, like, I blew my knee out, I could have went pro. Oh, yeah, The script is perfect for me. I got it. Hey there. You put Sorry, that big skin in there. You last I'll catch night. it. But is it because he was white, so he never got to run that fast? No, here's, so here's why was he running around. around. Like you notice, he like, was they were breaking every once in a while. Like they're the real person was sleeping oh, yeah, through yeah, every yeah, once in yeah. a while. Yeah. So that was probably like him. Like he broke through and he was like, "Fuck, I gotta get the fuck out of here!" Like before I get a chance. And then like the the white man took over. That's like almost like transracial. Actually, he nah, was man, it's like the white people are like Rachel the black guy. Like, I want to be him. She did do it first. Actually, you know what? Sean Connery did it first. In what? In the fucking the uh, rock. I forget the I forget the, the rock. No, I forget the name of which James Bond it was. But he the leg he of got like surgery Japanese. so he could go undercover to as a blood. Japanese man. Oh. Doctor No, was that it? I think it's Doctor No. Yeah, and then he also this listen, was back in the seventies. I'm guessing this this bothers it's me. All of James Bond. Yeah. Okay. What I'm about to tell you bothers me more than anything else has ever bothered me in film. Sean Connery was in the movie Highlander, which takes place in the Scottish Highlands, and he played a Spanish man named Ramirez, where they just gave him a bad spray tan. And he has this, like, and this is a, a I think a Craig Ferguson bit, kind of, but he was just like, and they make him, like, say the line, he's like, yes, tell me of Scotland, for I am from Spain, and I have never visited here before. And it's just like, what the fuck, He didn't even dude? have an accent? No, he, still just talk like he just talked like Sean Connery. <laughs> he talked funny. like Con- Sean Connery when he was supposed to be a British spy. He talked like Sean Connery when he was supposed to be a Russian submarine commander. It's like Keanu, <laughs> it's like Keanu Reeves. It's like he's gonna play the same dude. No oh my god! When he tried when doing. he tried to do an English accent in fucking Bram Stoker's Dracula, <laughs> bro, he I can't. I just I. Con! <laughs> it's so bad. He was in Toy Story 4 too, and he did the same exact. Uh, no, he was playing like a, a stunt <laughs> man, <laughs> evil type. Yeah, like a stunt man, motorcycle. Yeah, evil can evil. I don't know. Yeah. Oh my god. Jeff, buddy, are you? Are you really? Uh, you I go hard you. in the paint, man. What? I'm when fine. you? Dr- I didn't ask you. I'm just saying. What? That's what you're gonna ask. Are you okay? I was gonna ask you to bring the microphone a little closer to your face, if you don't mind. Which is, thanks, thanks, buddy. I think that'd be a hard thing to ask. Thanks, but. buddy. I'm good. No, you can lean back. You can just bring a motherfucker with you. That's the great thing about these arms. Is it, you know, if I want to sit what? over here, I sit uh-huh. over here. If I want to sit over here. He's about to start falling you guys, asleep. Yeah, you, you guys went balling the other day. Basketball. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah I mean, it was you some too. of the worst basketball I've ever you played. Oh, and Stevie J. I'm, I'm in pain. Stevie J assured us that he could grab the rim <laughs> and was an entire foot short. Yes, I'm not no exaggerating idea. at all. Was it Was it not a full foot? He stuttered a step before he jumped. <laughs> he went from a full sprint to a stutter step. He was a foot short. Was, yeah. I was blown when he said of it. I was like, rim. damn, dude, that's impressive. If you can still grab rim at your height. like, Because he's like fucking, what, five, six? Yeah, maybe, yeah. And I was just like, damn, dude, if you, you got ups like that. And then he tried to do it. And he, I mean, it was... 
It was so <laughs> hilariously bad. Like it was so hilariously short. I could I could tell I knew once he stuttered before he jumped, I was like, oh, he's, the, he's not gonna be able to touch it. The him. approach looked so bad. It just it looked like it looked like when Forrest Gump's leg braces were breaking off and he's like <laughs> stepping out of them and he's just like, uh, uh. it's looked like he just got new legs. He just got new legs. Stevie J got new legs. And he ran and he ran and he ran. And then he jumped an entire foot short. He jumped and that motherfucker and missed then, it. And then to try and like salvage his self respect, he's like, but I got net. <laughs> I was like, this bottom of the net, it's so far from the rim. <laughs> but I got net. That's like bowling and you get a gutter ball, but it's like, at least it touched the lane. <laughs> I was like, like, at least I made it in my lane. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to Stevie J, man. That motherfucker's funny, man. Stevie J is funny. I bet Stevie J does bump, solid mid range jump too. shot. Fantastic mid-range jump shot. I will say that. He's too black, man. <laughs> what the fuck? What do you mean? That's why he's a good jump shot. I bet Stevie J does bumper bowling when he goes bowling. <laughs> you think? I think all the glitter boys do bumper bowling when they go bowling. Because everybody deserves a fair chance. It's like you at least hit one pin, you know. I want to know. Like Jeff, I want to circle back to the granny porn because I'm. I can't. I can't escape this. What do you mean? So. What what it was it, is it, it is there anything else, uh like to it or is it just you liked watching an old lady get railed? Nah, man, it has is to it be like, like a, is it like a grandma? It has, to be like, step- it has to be like a granny with body, man. She has to like fucking have nice knockers, big but the, old butt but they're cheeks. They're gonna be sagging so bad. Oh, sagging tits are the best, dude. Bro. Do you not like? I like um, I like blemishes, I like <laughs> freckles, I like pimples, I like uh, sagging tits. Who hurt you? I like uh, I like midgets, man. Midgets have fucking big, fucking juicy butt heads. cheeks. They have big heads. Heads too, but <laughs> butt cheeks. Yeah. They're you know what, built you know like what? fucking drumsticks. You know how I got that bit about like if you get molested when the right thing is happening. <laughs> I've never seen you mol- be into anything. Thing? You got I'm, molested while watching Beetlejuice, and now you just <laughs> like all these freaks, all these people of it. Incorrect sizes, ages, and blemishes. I wish, Are you I getting molested? And his granny. Was it, but I've never his grandma molested. walked in as he was getting molested. And he what busted. was your What was your first sexual experience like? And I'm not talking like the first time you lost your virginity. Like the first time, like you jerked off. What were you jerking <sighs> off to? Microphone. Um, I think it's a. Uh, it was a. Uh, oh, no. I'll tell you mine. It's disgusting. It's probably like a Coles catalog. Like an underwear thing. Yeah, I was looking at the guys, and they had uh, big bulges. So, I knew it. You're gay. I knew it. What? Well, how's that gay? I'm like, gay. I'm just jerking off to men's bulges. Is what? Yeah, what? Mine's what? Was mine. I haven't had sex yet. I don't Wait, know what go, I am. I can promise you, mine's is more weird than him. You guys is fucking what? What? You go for it. You go, and I'll tell you about. No, uh, it. the first thing that I can remember, obviously, no, it was like, obviously it was, it was like movies like that, that like alluded a... to like sex. But um, I remember. No, wait. Can I, can I answer for real? Yeah. That sex scene and Wild Things. Wild Things? Where the Wild oh, Things with, are? Uh, Drew Barrymore with... and fucking Denise Richards and Matt Dillon. Okay. No, that was, I, I, that, I no, that was Nev Campbell. Nev Campbell. Nev Campbell. And Denise Richards. Yeah, dude. And yeah, Matt Dillon. absolutely. I stroked it to that when I was like, yeah. a fuck, I was like 11 years old. Yeah. And then I was like, uh, uh. Nice. That's Ejected. Nice. I finished. Okay. Now all, all over my you own go, face. Yo, I, mine is very uh, right, that's too much. But no, I jacked up. I, uh, I can't it. remember like the first scene, but it was definitely like a, a like a TV movie. Oh, I think it might have been Starship Troopers. Dude, Desi, the that girl that played that Desi, curly hair girl yeah. that dies. His fuck girl that Richards. was supposed to. Yeah, fuck her. Richards in that, in that movie, movie, that curly Desi hair was girl, the fucking cheeks. That was, was it. she had Blonde cheeks, girl, she had right? titties. Oh, no, she had curly, curly hair. She had curly brown hair. It was his Big home tits. girl. It was his home girl yes. before like he left yeah, and went and like, became. They knew each other before yeah, he and left. Then they, and then they fucking, like, she died in his arms. And I remember yeah. being sad because I knew that I wouldn't see her tits again in the movie. <laughs> uh, dude, it did I show wasn't sad that she died. I was like, oh, fuck, man. That means no more of her tits in this movie. Fuck. They're not going to fuck again. She How was old sexy. were you, yo? She's like a tom- that's like a tomboy I mean, with curly I mean, hair. It has to be 12 because I had seen the movie before. Mm. and uh, But I think I remember it, like it was on like TNT or... TBS or one of those and I remember like going like it was when you know the parents were asleep and I was just on the couch like uh, yeah, I don't really know. Know. <laughs> you guys have so much better like... stories okay, okay hit me. Uh, Jeff I, I how old were you, how old were you I mean my dad had pornos that I found too so I was watching like 
That's you had a, videos? Some Oh, he was like VHS a rich kid on the, It's like being uh, rich. VHS is nice. Bro. Those one that is called Limp Shrimp. <laughs> Limp Shrimp. It's like it's a Amaz- it's like a black and white porn. <laughs> Limp Shrimp. Limp Shrimp. A Did- black and white porn. Yeah. What the fuck? No, seriously, fuck? listen to me. <coughs> Jeff's over here jerking off the silent movie. No, it, it was a porn. Charlie a porn. Chaplin type thing. It was a porn. Um, <laughs> he had to jerk off the subtitles. It's a porn. <laughs> it's a porn. And she, they just sit there and go, White, dude. mean, white dudes in the jungle. I'm white about d- to fuck your pussy raw. No, no, no. White, <laughs> white dude's in the jungle. He's pissing. He's pissing, right? And, like, some fucking Amazon, like, black chick, like, sees his shit. And she's like, huh? Huh? He's, like, pissing. And he's like, ah. Oh. She had, like, a spear. She had, like, a spear. <laughs> and there's, like, his dick was, like, fucking, like, flopping around and shit. And she's like, she's like, like fucking, like oh. batting her around. She's, oh. like, she's like a cave woman. Oh. Yeah, yeah. And she, she called, she's like, leap. she's like, leave tree, leave tree. She called it a limp, like limp trip, leap tree. They got big shrimp in the Amazon and shit. And like, so like, you know, she blo- she blows up, he bangs her, and like, she's like riding. She's like, leap tree, leap tree, leap tree, leap tree. And the dude's like, he's like, oh, he's like, I gotta take a break. He's like, I gotta take a break. And she's like. I'm looking at this. Yeah, lip trip. Lip trip. Lip trip. It's like you, 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 like you're in the jungle. You go off to the side of the piss, oh and some God. Amazon woman just fucking comes out of nowhere and like rapes you. So is it in like black and white because it's supposed to be like <laughs> no, no, it was in found color. footage like discovery. <laughs> like, it, was in, it was in color. It was a white guy. We are documenting our journey through the Amazon forest. We stumbled across a lonely tribe, and it turns out they were quite randy. Quite. <laughs> I can't find that. It. It, it was a gay porno site that popped up Limp on my shrimp. search. Yeah, this. Um, Limpshrip.com. Yeah, so when right, you guys oh, learn to jerk really off, I got to build up. I got so many questions I'm asking. Okay, okay, go ahead. Go so ahead. when you guys learn to jerk off, you guys did it the traditional, like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, so my first time jerking off was, um, so I was in Hookers my. Hookers at the point. I was HBO? in my bed. HBO? I was, was about, shut the fuck up. I was. Seven or eight. Jesus, man, that's so early. You piece of shit. You couldn't <laughs> come at seven or eight. No, it was, oh, I was so I was sad when I started coming. Oh, uh, he came. You were yeah. like, what? What are you? You were sad. You so had to clean up because I got my boxers got dirty. I was like, what is this? Yeah, it was anyway. So you were just jerking off for the love of the game? No, for he, like yeah. six years. <laughs> <laughs> it was like this is the best, and then no, you finish and like, boo. No, why is just, it, you would still or, off you would to or, no, no, I just want to chafe my dick for thirty minutes. You you orgasm, but nothing comes out. It was great. You can still have an orgasm. It's like he got a ball removed. He could just. I'm telling you because they lived not it. Not nut. You know? No, you could. You would just never. Nothing would come out, or it'd be like a clear liquid. It was not. It wasn't sperm. All right. Anyways, I'm building up to it. <laughs> so I was about seven or eight. Had a bad dream. So I went to sleep. I went to sleep in my mom's bed. She's asleep. Back is turned. Oh, I'm not on, a monster. Dude, don't tell me you fucking jerked off. I'm watching mom. Disney Channel. Lizzie McGuire comes on. No way. Ooh. What am I supposed to do? With your mom laying there? Back turned, Jeff. Back turned. And I don't, I didn't learn. So when I started jerking off, this is going to, I didn't do you it You threw this ropes way. on your mom. I, I, did, I couldn't come, so no. I didn't jerk this off is this is literally way. half the porn out today starts exactly oh this way. And I don't even like that type of category, <laughs> which so is weird. <laughs> I jerk off like I'm strumming a guitar. Like this. The whole, Gently. like, like oh, just, here's my dick. Ry- rhythmic? It, like, rhythmic? It's, it's just this. Whoa. Oh, my dick would hurt. So, <laughs> like, all four fingers? Bam, 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 bam. Like, you're just wow. fucking. Wow. Like again, sharpening a knife, you're just. Again, I highly recommend the YouTube for this one, ladies and gentlemen. Wow, that's fucking fascinating. And, okay. it, and it, it gets worse, so I, I developed a habit. <laughs> Not in my mom's room. That's, but that's how, how you I jerked s- it? That's how I jerked it until... So I, you're not supposed to jerk your dick that way. No. So my dick had... Like bruises and shit? <laughs> bruised, but the fucking skin around the head of my cock bubbled up like a, like a blister. <laughs> oh my god, man. And my mom can vouch because I ran into her room and they're like, Mom! It's broken, and it, she's like, "Did you? Did someone burn your dick?" And I was like, "No, I've been." You just blistered it up from friction. <laughs> for the, oh my god! It was like a fluid. No it, was a, it was a fluid. Like, <laughs> like my mom almost took me to the fucking doctors, like the hospital, and she's like, "What were you doing?" I was like, "I was, I was doing this to my dick, <laughs> <laughs> my penis." 
fuck out. So, you know, it's the most embarrassing shit I've ever heard in my life. Dude. <laughs> so dude, what the fuck? So, Why would you tell anybody? I thought that? me fucking a wet paper bag was no, bad. Dude. This is this it's, is pretty bad. I'm not proud of it, but then my dad was even more embarrassed because he had to have the talk with me at the age of like eight. He's like, you gotta quit touching. So dick. he asked me. He's quit like, so flicking your dick. He was trying not to laugh because my mom was trying to tell him, and he and he's like, that's not how you. That's not impossible. How does that work? <laughs> and like my dad was like, so how do you? Oh so he calls me in the room while he's like laying on the bed. I was like, great, back to my favorite spot, right? So he's like, <laughs> oh, he's I'm about to go jerking next to dad too. This is gonna be some quality <laughs> bonding. So he's talking. He's like, how do you do it? And he was like, the, he, I was like, I do, do, I, do it? I do this. He he turns his head not to laugh at me, <laughs> and, I'm like, and he turns back and he tries to be serious. He's like, no, seriously, how are you doing? I was like, I do that. He's like. Going forward, if you're gonna do it, which you're going to, you need to jerk it like this. And when he, he did huge motions, which made me so sad, because like, <laughs> that's how you know my dad's a big dick. And then I learned, and then it made it worse, because I jerk, I've been jerking off since I was like seven and a half. That's crazy. Yeah. That's so crazy. Well, I'm dedicated yeah, to the game. Been baby. Jerking <laughs> earlier, you know what I mean? If you ask me. I, don't, I think that's a pretty early Holy age. Holy shit, yeah. dude. So when I started coming, more and beer. I go to my mom. I was like nine. Yeah. I went to her. <laughs> I said, Mom, something's leaking out of my dick. And she says, Whoosh. Let me see it, baby. Let about, me see it, baby. 12 when you start coming. 12 or 13. Let me see your dick. And she said, oh, that's called semen. And I was like, oh. Oh, neat. <laughs> neat, like, Mama. Yeah, I thought I was dying. Mama, Mama. <laughs> I thought I was dying. I thought, I'm ejaculating. Help, Mama. You, my mom, you, you can bring multi stories up to her. She will contest like, yeah, my son's a sicko. She's, no shit. She's like you're, you, yeah. So that Jesus was Jesus Christ, you fucking degenerate. You were jerking off for six years before you could bust a nut. That's crazy. Yeah, it's like the good. It's the good times, man. Six years of just frustrated j- masturbation. I just, I couldn't imagine. That means he watched all these pornos we're talking about. He watched the fucking. I know. didn't start watching. He watched the shit. You've yeah. We should be off. asking him what the fuck he's the watching. Weirdest shit I've over here off jerking too. off at five years old. I accidentally, um, I caught myself in time. I clicked on a video because it had reverse cowgirl. Mm-hmm. And it was anal. And I was like, oh, let me check. This is a big no ass. Way. So I click on it and I'm watching and I'm starting to, I'm starting to stroke. It's about, a about a minute and a half. And yeah, there was a dick that popped out. And I was like, oh, you got me. You sneak. Cause it wasn't, it wasn't the trans category. They snuck it in there. Oh, they snuck it. Yeah. Yeah. So I, 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 I stopped. I was like, is this, is this wrong? You know, because yeah. they got me already. I'm hooked. No, but like, so, do I let know, go of totally the hook? Like, something always gave me an inkling. I've suspected. I always knew you were I've a B. I'm not gay. Something always told me you were a B. I'm able to say a because I, a fe- a he's trying to say bee. fag, but he's saying feed because he's he's a fucking B. Because he gets into this just, weird Italian it. character. Like even he's when he's trying to bee. read, I don't know why you do that. A P. You're really you just buying into that fucking Wario lookalike shit, aren't you? I guess. <laughs> you fucking meatball with a mustache. Wah! <laughs> Yale doesn't get it because he's also a P. I see why Lucas fucking hates you, dude. <laughs> what do you mean? He moved Lucas, away Lucas would re- laugh at this. No, actually, that's no, like the one like, thing. That's the one thing no, of this whole Lucas podcast. Would like, like, Jeff, Lucas would laugh at Jeff would be, He'd be like, Jeff, what are you doing? Me calling you guys figs. That's like the one Let's thing. Let's call him right now and ask him, is that Newton? fucking funny? He'd yeah, like, call him. He's like, why are you guys hanging out? He's like, why are you guys calling Yeah, call him up. Call him up right now. I do, but he's not going to answer. He's probably at Costco working. He's not going to answer. He don't know you, dude. I text Lucas like once every two weeks. He literally texts me no. to ask how you're doing. And I'm like, he's he still hate, alive. He hates you guys. No, he doesn't. Yeah. He's probably. Just, he hates. Yeah, probably. He's you just, want him to hate us so bad. He doesn't. He hates you. No, he doesn't. He needs you to check on me to make sure I'm not dead. Because he doesn't care enough to check on you himself. <laughs> That's why he asks us. He's like, what's the what's going on? I was like, he's still kicking. He's like, good. So <laughs> when we're texting each other, that's just what? That's just We're just fucking around there? You, when you're texting him, getting then he's leaving you on red. When he's texting me, he doesn't text you, bro. I'm an actor, and you're acting is like he he, an act- you're is acting he, like he texts you, which he is doesn't. Is he an actor? I guess he's a comic. Yeah, he, is he all, a booked comic? We're actually all. Is he actors. a booked comic? Booked more does, than you. Yeah. He's, does, does he have Jeff, a show? You're not booked on shit. Does he have a show next Saturday? What are you booked on? Are you finally? I'm doing booked a on show? Hood Panda Show. Everybody's booked on Hood Panda Show. His flyer has like eighteen. Not people. you. 
I could show up and get not a you. I could show up and get a spot, Jeff. Not if I, I have promise. fucking just something, something to say you about it. You have nothing to say about I'll it. I'll have a couple things to say about it. You bought this nigga rollerblades to get on the show. <laughs> you want? Look, man, <laughs> Maybe you did actually, that's, that's not, not, hurt, that's not the point. That's not what I'm saying. Did. did you buy him some like, new wheels? How the fuck did you find out? Did about you buy him? I bought some new little glowing wheels. <laughs> but that's not the point. You got him some all-terrain <laughs> wheels. Just shut up. Man. Hold on. What if he's getting serious? Like, just don't show up, dude. That's I want to circle thing. back to the porn for a second because oh, it wasn't me, grandmas, but a girl. Uh, one of the girls that I saw used to like date. Um, she told me that. Uh, about how guilty she felt because she was masturbating to a porn, mm-hmm. and uh, be- she was like getting close to finishing, and then it got really weird, and she just finished anyway. But they sprayed whipped cream up the other person's asshole, it's not and bad. then like <laughs> farted it into their mouth. I've seen that. That's not that bad. That's not that's weird. So gross. That's not Sounds bad at all. High. That's not that bad. That's not that bad. No. That's pretty bad. That's you, called. You I know the porno she's talking. It's called anal acrobats. <laughs> <laughs> know what she's talking about? You see? <laughs> yeah. Hold on. I want to know what else you fucking seen where you go. Oh, they that's got one. They bad. got that's, one that's where they shove uh, they shove pool balls in there. It's anal acrobats. It's like the Olympics for anal sex. Man. Oh my god. Yeah, dude. some of the hottest porn stars do it. They got what? Have you seen the the Fruit Loops one where they eating Fruit Loops out the ass? Well, that seems more reasonable. It's, I think that's part of anal acrobats. <laughs> But yeah, they got one where they did uh, like hot dogs and ketchup and mustard. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's, <laughs> that's just that's just a good waste of condiments right there. Like, oh yeah, they just, use a lot wasting, of they use a lot of dude. Lot we of should cream. We wasting should, good condiments. We right should here. start like a fucking OnlyFans show. You know, acrobats where we up. just fucking watch along the craziest porns. Two thousand and seven, you know, acrobats. No, I'm not wrong. Wow, it's a real thing. All right. And how old were you in 2007? 13. See? Yeah, they get some real shit going on. Damn, dude. Ain't no acrobats, yeah. I know what she's talking about. It's insane. I don't even know what that one is, but... Here, Jeff. I know you want to lean the little chair over here. I can't. They have a fucking chain a and bathtub guy. plug shoved in their assholes of, of some kind. Yeah, yeah, like no, that, that's, a, that's a toy. Plug. That's a toy that will that will, <laughs> yeah, that will vibrate one, they, and expand. They shove like a ass. generator in one girl's ass, and then they plug oh, it no, out. Oh, she bleeding it. everywhere? No, that's just oh, a, no. That's oh, a oh, red shit. dildo. Well, <laughs> hold on, the girl's red fingernails make it look like they were blood drops. Oh, and like, oh I'm gonna just type in whipped cream. I'm pretty sure I know the scene she's talking about. I don't want to. Don't bring it up now. Fucking bring it up later when I'm alone. Jeff, can you leave the room? Send it to me when everybody leaves. The whipped cream thing is a very hot thing going on in the porn community right now, actually. Yeah, I don't know. You guys are on. fucking virgins, all right? Oh, I have a friend request from somebody named The Rising of a Goddess. <laughs> what is, is that? Is that Australia's new Facebook page? I don't know. You got like a dun- like something Dungeons and Dragons game for, like, coming up? Or? or something. I play, Jeff. What What of it? The, the Legends of Agnotis. Agnotis. Yeah. I've never played it. I wanted to get into it, but I was scared that if I asked any of my black friends, they would call me a fag. You want You're to jump a in fucking on faggot. D- what does it do? You're a faggot. What do I do? I'll I want talk to, to you about it. Later. I want to be the highest powered person in the game. Yeah. You you're okay. gonna you're gonna, gonna be, be a, a lot dragon? more you're gonna be a lot more you discipline and practice. You can be a dragon born. <laughs> I don't want to be a baby dragon. I want to be like. You know, it's just like, like starting an RPG. Pretty, you gotta start yeah. from the fucking beginning. Your yeah. dude's not gonna be shit unless you build yeah. your deck. Or whatever the fuck. Yeah, you build that it's, deck. It, it's super that nerdy. It's, I'm going to log in with my level. No, that's that's uh, World of Warcraft. You're saying it's super nerdy, but you're getting really into detail about it. I feel like no, you that's do World of Warcraft. I was like, I'm going to log in with my level 86 fire mage. Boom, everybody. Do you play grid. World of Warcraft? No, Please. I don't. You have the body I'm too busy of acting. Does. That's why I asked. Too acting busy doing, what? I'm too busy acting and doing comedy. Jeff, I have a real question. Why wear the do-rag when you have long hair? You got beautiful hair, yeah. That's annoying. I have, I have, a, I have a fucking complex about it. Why? Because I used to have dreadlocks, and okay. now I don't. And when I cut my dreadlocks, I felt like I cut like half of my uh, personality. You fucking off. grow your dreadlocks back, bro. Well, you fuck can still you. get it. Bra- life, you... ain't, life ain't that easy. Why did you have dreadlocks? Because I was a thug. You would look so fucking weird. With if you dreadlocks. if you fucking miss them that bad, start start growing dreadlocks. What do you think I'm doing? Not Twiddling getting... my thumbs. Well, I mean, can you grow dreadlocks underneath a fucking yeah? No, you oh, can't. Right. What do you mean, no, you can't? You're not even... You have to get them twisted first, don't you? Well, yeah. I mean, the idea would be you get braids for, like, a couple it's weeks. It's super long enough. It's long enough to do that. Why are you not doing it? 
It's beyond fuck you enough. is why I'm a fucking procrastinating piece of shit. What do you want? Like, it's past what you should have done. Sure. By the way, quit saying you're an actor because every comedian's an actor. I'm an actor. We all act out bits on stage. How many how many uh, short films have you been in? One. How many have you been in? The same one that I... Yeah, I'm on the same okay. one with you. Yeah, so well, I don't know where you're going with that. Okay, well... Like, gonna... you act like you write new jokes and you I'm don't. A... Are, you, are, you, are you sure about that? <laughs> Positive. <laughs> I feel like I make way more of an effort to the do fact new jokes that than you, you were do. The, you okay, were the, Jeff. That's not true at no. all. I, I have so <laughs> many different five-minute sets. The fact that you were the lead comedian and you're a comedian in real life, and then he had to have the crowd say, throw out some jokes for him, and we all had to throw out jokes for you, means you suck. That doesn't you mean stink. I suck. I don't you fucking stink. do jokes like that. Oh, I don't, don't do be fucking, an asshole. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't do no, jokes like that. I don't do, you, I don't do jad, you, like you. You agree with this? I don't do dad jokes. I don't do one liners. Like I don't fucking. I don't write like that. Like I don't have jokes for that. That's like all Google jokes. Some would say you don't do jokes That's at all. all. <laughs> I don't. Say that. You just I told me not that. to be I don't, mean. I don't, I don't you say that. Punch him in the face. I don't man. say that. I think you're fucking hilarious. The, the streets are talking. Some would say I don't do jokes at all. Well, whatever you guys got to tell yourselves I'm sorry. to make it seem like you're still in the race. No, Jeff, I'm going to be honest To be with as you. funny as when, Jeff Lodala. Whatever you got to tell when yourself. When I first started comedy. Sounds good to me, man. I, when I first started comedy, I saw you headline at uh, uh, Saber Pint. And, and it you, blew your fucking you mind. You fucking crushed. Oh, man, I did so good. You crushed. I but got now, your email, and I was like excited to be in contact with you. And now I'm like, I hate when you call me. Like it changed within I a year. I don't call you. <laughs> you do. It's always when when you call me. When do I ever call you? you when do you need a ride? You gonna pick me up? <laughs> <laughs> you don't even text. I don't call. No, you do. When he calls you, when you, when you do call, he doesn't even. It doesn't say hi. It's like you gonna pick me up. <laughs> so what's up, the deal? Dude? You gonna pick me up tonight or pick what? Me, you pick me up That's or what? That's literally what it is. I'm like, I guess, Jeff. <laughs> it's never how's your day. He's like, cool. <laughs> you and Olima are fucking pieces of shit. Why do you guys do? I was like, what did don't I do? Fucking, don't loop me in with her black ass. <laughs> you always blame me because Fuck she. Fuck you, t- y'all motherfuckers. No, you motherfuckers won't let me like just fucking be. Like I, I, <laughs> I would, I would love to just. Get off work and go home. Like, oh, no, there's open mic. You're not a comedian anymore. Why don't you come out anymore? You do the same jokes. You guys I, fucking drag me out We this fucking shit. love you and want you to keep you doing stand-up, you idiot. Well, I, I know that. Don't be fucking mad at us for trying to continue to support you. And I'm I, also wasn't, I wasn't quitting in the first place. It's like you guys drag me out of the shit. And it's like, oh, you're, you're getting too drunk. I said, like, well, fuck you. I could have just You haven't home. proved this wrong because the one time I did come to get you, you were too drunk and you never came to the door. <laughs> That's true. I mean, but fuck <laughs> you. You asked for Jeff Adala, you see what you get. And plus, I know if I'm picking you up. You asked for Jeff Adala. Lowest... This dude's over here drinking absinthe. <laughs> That's fucking, not even absinthe. Fucking green Kool-Aid. No, it's funny. What Let him have it. This? It looks like oh, absinthe. Let him have it. It's the, it's Don't the jo- step on people's jokes on this. It's the joke It's the joke potion. It is. Did you have to drink that last night? It looks like fucking... Uh, I, drank, I drank fucking makeup. You drank because, it? They made you drink I'm it? An, I'm an actor. They really made you drink it? Are yeah, you, the, you the alright? Did it fuck you up? The tequila, I mean, it... Did it taste good? It didn't taste like anything, but like I had like glitter in my mouth and all over my... Did you fingers. have diarrhea? I was like, dude, I got I I shit. I, I, I shit a little glitter turd. Like, that was like my... <laughs> did, did it really look like it? Yeah. That that's first turd after, I had a little glitter. That's fucking cool, We dude. should start like a rivalry to the glitter boys and call it the, gli- the shitter boys. The shitter boys. Uh, we no, just I told eat makeup I told, and then <laughs> shit out like glittery turds. Yeah, I told Halima we're gonna call. We're gonna <laughs> me and Halima actually talking about. This. We're gonna be called the sparkling pussies. Uh, the sparkling <laughs> yeah. pussies. Yeah. The sparkling oh yeah, you know, we're talking, yeah I think we called it like sparkle fags. We were called the sparkle fags at one point. Sparkle, sparkle fags. fags. That's a little hit. Sparkling pussies. We can everybody. Sparkling in, pussies. Everybody in the community is gonna love us for that one. Sparkling pussies. What jokes are I'd we rather, gonna do? I'd to rather compete? say the sparkling fags though. We're we gonna start a war with the glitter boys. Uh, all our jokes uh, have to be about how white men are evil. White men are evil. Yeah. We love everybody. And we got it. Can I? I guess I'm the Stevie J. Of the we're group. not. Glitter- no, Halima's our Stevie J. We're not glittering. We're sparkling. We're sparkling, bitches. <laughs> you fucking fags. Yeah. Glitter. The sparkle queefs. What about sparkle queefs? Sparkle queefs? The sparkle queens. The sparkle queens. Yeah. Yes. Sparkle, sparkle. How about, how about the fucking cum gulpers? That's not even remotely close to what the angle we're trying to That's think. actually the last porn that I jerked off to. Come uh, golfers. And we brought it for a little circle. <laughs> the glitter boys. Just gulping it. I know. Hey, should we wrap this bitch up? I don't know no, how man, long we've been you guys, recording. You guys are mad. What? Mad? Nobody's mad. mad at you. What are you, Why mad, are you mad about? 
I'm You're an actor. actor. You're doing great. You're on a movie I'm an with actor. me and Yale. No, fucking acknowledge that I'm an actor. Yeah, you're, me, we're I've a, told like 20 people today and nobody oh, ca- Everybody's nobody's talking cared. about Jeff Liddell. They call him the Wu-Tang Whale. Everybody's <laughs> talking about Jeff Liddell. <laughs> yeah, I'm like a beached Wu-Tang For whale. the audio listeners, he is wearing a Wu-Tang shirt. With pizza on it. Just fitting for him, actually. The Wu-Tang Home whale. of the Shaolin Slice, though. <laughs> yeah, of course we eat a food-themed, or have a wear a food-themed Wu-Tang shirt. You wouldn't eat. You wouldn't eat at a pizza place that was the home of the Shaolin Slice. I'd probably try it out. Yes, absolutely. Especially if they put out pizzas in the shape of the fucking Wu Tang symbol. That'd be oh, but that'd awesome. be hard for like a pizza party. That would be to fucking tough, man. That would be because that'd be tough. like they'd have to be personal awful. pizzas. But you realize how many? Nah, if you down do you with realize how many soul. white people that listen to two fucking Wu Tang songs would come down there, take a picture on Instagram, and make them a shit ton of money? Do you know who Jeff Liddell is? I know, like I was a tattoo of Wu Tang on him. And uh, he's still uh, nothing yeah. to fuck with. It is. Do you know who Jeff Liddell is? You hear that? Is? We're fucking coming for you, We're glitter boys. We're coming for you, glitter boys. We're fucking starting a war. Sparkling pussy. I have nothing to do with yeah. this. What's my, uh, my, I'm uh, starting shit with Eric Basso. I'm starting shit oh, with are Funny, you? Guy Fish Funny Guy Fish. And We're that stupid cereal show that We're I was coming on. for you, brother. And I was like, We're, we are starting We're shit. We are coming for you, brother. What's up, bitches? Do something. Well, they you c- fucking pussies. Do something. Well, their thing is the boys, so what is ours? The men. <laughs> All right, fair enough. And he's back. The men. Every time somebody has our boys, they go, men. The earth tones men. The earth tones men. <laughs> the men haters. Well, what, what's your problem with Funny Guy Fish? Is he max? No, is we he were just a black podcast or war. No, we were just uh, talking random shit about his show. Yeah, Ty Ty came here right and did our podcast right after he did his. So we just started being like, nah, fuck that show. He's going to fucking eat on fucking camera. That shit sucks. So you guys Stupid. were mad because he and had And then I went and did a show like a week later. <laughs> and yeah, then, then you he went, went and did a show. Yeah. Well, you're not even on the Centrals no more. You want to start You want to start in the Centrals? You want to be fucked with the Centrals? No, they're too? doing it. We, 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 we replaced it. It's a different show. He has it out now. They we started, we they started, started the exact same show, but just without Lucas. Who's the host? Is it, oh, is it Jeffrey Allen? Henry, Henry, Henry Allen. Yeah. Henry Allen. Bitch. What's and it called? And we've been together three times. Uh, the Henry Allen show right now. This is how long you've been a pot. Yeah, like, like, uh, this is how long you've been like a sidekick your whole life. You didn't just think to start your own. <laughs> you just jump on someone else's podcast. You know how to podcast. Why don't you just do your own? Well, it's a, really, guess, it's a guess, good question. Yeah, you, why didn't I think of that? Because you, you know we'd all be on it. You're funny. <laughs> he doesn't. He has. He spends all his spare money on drugs and alcohol. He can't. Do you think I'm James equipment. Godwin? Do you think I have all the mics and the fucking... You know him and you just James you Godwin's it. on it and he's not funny, but you know... <laughs> he's part of the show for some Why reason. Didn't you just Lucas start... didn't even like him. This is... Do, we have, do you want us to cut this out? No, <laughs> no. yeah, cut it out. Why does Lucas no, not I'm like... Not, he's not going to listen hey, to this. Listen, listen to me right now. I do not cut shit out, so don't... I don't give a fuck. Okay. <laughs> You, they're in Germany you have that right same now. Found out that was fucking they're lying. in Germany. That no, was listen, a fucking listen. Lie. They're, they're in Germany right now. Uh, for some reason, they all work together. The chick who was my fake girlfriend, she works for them. They're doing like two card games. They're in like a comic con in Ger- Germany for card Why games. Why are there unfunny games. people writing for this card game? He got Henry Allen. He got Shayna. I feel like he just What's recruited Shayna because she has huge cities. Yeah, dude, I work on the same game. I know. Yeah, he was a writer. I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm aware of the team. What are they doing in Germany? Uh, it's a gaming convention. I, know, I didn't go I know, because I didn't well, have enough time to get both rounds of the vaccine. So that's why I couldn't go. But yeah, but what, I'm still, I'm what's, the, what's the point of them actually going there? Meeting up to uh, like network and like uh, kind of like show <laughs> their <laughs> idea and try and like open it up to like market services. Network. Yeah. There was a gaming. But convention. you're pitching. You're pitching two card games that essentially has already been out. Cyanide and Happiness no, they're, and they're, Cards Against Humanity. That's what your no, it's, shit is. It's. It's a little it's, bit different. You make you make a you make a comic with it, or it's like the other one that's the the cards. It's Seems basically, like you it's know very car- little about the whole thing. <laughs> Go ahead. Yeah, everything that you said is exactly true, Jeff. No, it's like a it's like a fucking yeah, it's like a fucking yeah, it's like a fucking it's like a fucking it's a it's a fucking. I don't know why. I want to know why Lucas didn't like James. Are you just saying that because it's not proper? I feel, I feel like it's just Jeff talking shit. I'm saying on, on the podcast. Oh, he didn't like him on the he podcast? Had, he had all the recording equipment, and it's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's like half the time that we were recording the episodes, he was like, man, I really wish he would just yeah, shut the fuck up. 
I know. I remember when I but did. You can't tell him to shut the phone. When up, I did, because he's the, the one recording you. When I did just the essentials, and uh, Lucas thought that I hated him the entire episode. Everybody thought you hated them when we first met you. <laughs> <laughs> and he like, here's the thing: like, he we're, like, we were cracking on each other like a little bit, and like the entire time, like I keep doing it because like I think that we're fucking with each other like for the sake of it being funny and then we stop recording he's like like seriously man did I upset you and I was like huh what I was like I thought we were fucking around that whole time <laughs> like he, he legitimately thought that I disliked him and I was like why what what reason what reason do I have to dislike you that's like him and Shayna with their like fake argument it's like I want to be disliked oh man you dislike me you know what I mean it's like Lucas He's an asshole, but he's not. You know what I mean? Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Like, it's mm-hmm. for the sake of cop. He's a fucking hilarious dude. One of the most funniest people I've ever met. One of the nicest life. people, by the way, too. Yeah, yeah. but, like, he's, he's an asshole, dude. but he's not. That's why, like, he would be like, he'll joke around, but then like, he doesn't really know. Like, he's like hey, I just want to, you know, I'm just fucking around. Yeah, when you. we told him the original, like, like he, like, he, when we told him the original idea for the <laughs> title of this podcast. He was like basically outside. He's like, "Yeah, what the hell's wrong with you guys? Are you okay?" No, he doesn't get us. He just doesn't. <laughs> get was it the jerk offs? Was the jerk offs? No, it was worse. Den, den, den debauchery. Oh yeah, after. that's that's different. Uh, after, after. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you can't even make the air. You can't say it. I'll tell you. I'll tell you. Well, we'll step outside. I don't. Tell me later. But it's it starts with the K. It starts with the K. It starts with the K. Don't tell me it's the KKK podcast. No. He said it started with a K. No. Right. no, no, we're not. Why not? We're not. No. Why not? No, no. freedom of speech. Freedom of speech. Lower your That's voice. That's why Jeffrey. we can't be in a room in serious shit. Because I felt really bad yesterday. You can make a KKK podcast if you want. I did. know, because we just we're just, just sitting there, we're just making fun of everybody. And like, it's funny. and we just could not stop talking shit about the entire production last night. Yeah, yeah. And I was like, we're and it was just, <laughs> and I had to like shoot him a message, be like, hey, dude, I know like wasn't playing, but thank you for letting us be a part of it. Because I just, I know that people, like, I just can't sit there quietly not talking shit. I'm not just going to sit there and I'm watch it and not say something. I'm just going to not call I'm you. I'm going to roast you. Yeah. If I see a roast happening in my head, I'm going to acknowledge it. I'm going to say he, it. Just like, Did he like, say it's okay? I understand. It's all good. I don't know, man. Because what, what if he tells it. you that, like, don't worry about it, and then we go watch the short film and we're not in it. He, cuts, he just he cuts, cuts us out, us out completely. completely. He's like, you want to... Oh, he so just you want to talk shit about my movie? Oh my god, that's so fucking good. It's funny, he, he uses our voices for Brian Harris's five minute set. <laughs> <laughs> he just cuts out Brian's jokes. It's just like, it's it's just like him on stage, like but it's, like your, your it's, a, it's our like voices. This. Yeah, it's our jokes, though, because they were great. And he uses both of ours. Yeah, just so go, it's just like it's three like, what different voices. <laughs> it's like. <laughs> <laughs> How bad of it is he has to go Brian right back did a into a fucking full set? <laughs> and he's just like, hey, go up there and do like one minute of jokes. And then Brian Harris goes up there and just keeps fucking going. Does and like to the five point minutes. W- to the point where Eric actually lit him. I laughed so hard when Eric fucking lit him. <laughs> There's no way he's cutting you two out of that movie. There's uh, no way. He might. Did you like our sets? Yeah. No. Oh. I didn't see you. Oh. I saw him. I made it a point not to, to not watch you. Yeah, because okay. fuck you, 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 bro. You've been getting oh. cocky lately. You know I, mean? I haven't. Yeah, yeah you, dude. You just get drunk and think I'm cocky. You, you, you just been being like a good guy and driving me around and shit. Fuck uh, you. No, I guess that's cocky. Yeah, fuck you, you nice piece of shit. Yeah, fuck you. Just you, get, you, you just you showing off friend. your car. Fuck you. Fuck you, helpful homo. I'm going to make You're it You're a piece of shit, man. You're always helping me out. He keeps saving himself because I'm about to say I'm not taking you home. He's like, you're a piece of shit because you're such a good guy. You know, I can't really <laughs> help you. Please take me home. Please, please. <laughs> please, bro. That's the one thing he has to cut <laughs> please, out. Can you please, cut that? Can you please cut bro. That out? Please, bro. Please, please take me home. Please, bro. So you got, please take you me got please, anything bro. in the works coming up, though, Jeff? Yeah, yeah I'm, doing, I'm doing that Hood Panda show okay. next um, Saturday. Week. I'm going to try yeah. to. I'm on the Ian Miller show, and then I'm going yeah, to try to get comes out. Wait, where's it? This comes out on Wednesday. Same day. So if anybody's listening to the fucking Columbus, why am I bothering to plug shit as if we have any reach or audience? Why would I even bother? Because everybody loves it. Def Goldblum's listening to this right now, and he was in the movie with me. What's his scene? Goldblum's. What well, does he play? Like a like a. He out said, of place he, said he, he enjoyed you guys' other episode. I listened to Facebook, so yeah. he's listening to this shit. That was only one episode, though. He hasn't heard the other ones. Yeah, I put out I put out one episode on audio. 
Well, more people are listening to this than people are listening to Lucas's solo episodes. So, oh, fuck you, <laughs> Lucas. <laughs> so it's yeah, funny guy fuck fish, you. Lucas. Who else are we fucking with? Uh, Eric Boso. Eric Boso, even though Bossa, he's on our podcast, which I think, which I think he's going to be on the podcast. He's, on, he's like going to Eric Boso. You're on the podcast. Bossa, fuck motherfucker. you until then, bro. Fuck you, yeah, Eric. You don't know how to make no fucking Little movies. Bitch ass, ass booty hole boy. Fake ass. Fuck Quentin you, Eric. Tarantino looking ass motherfucker. <laughs> fuck you, but you better be here next Tuesday around ten o'clock, please. Yes. Who please else? come over and do it. Please That'd come over. That'd be really yes. cool. That'd be really cool. And any other movies you got coming up, you piece of shit. Yeah. Put me in so I can be the lead actor and kill. You know what? I'm yeah, even with you because fucking goddamn Xavier Dunson called you the king of roasts, and I was about to fucking lose my shit. And fuck you, you know, I guess. Damn. So fuck Call Xavier, Toil- fuck him, and Xavier. fuck Xavier for saying that shit. Fuck Xavier. Toilet right. the king of roasts, really, so Xavier? Fucking, yeah. With your Serena Williams looking ass, <laughs> Xavier is the king of roasts. <laughs> Serena Williams. <laughs> it would have been Dang, so much been funnier in that if movie you said will, Venus. Yeah, he should have been in that movie. Will Smith. Gonna be like, what did she look like? Should have been Venus Williams. Did they look the same? She's still alive. <laughs> she has I love how she dies. I love how there's two sisters, and one of them just has like, you just don't even talk about. <laughs> Do not mention her. It's not gonna go over great. It's like Serena Williams and that other one. What the fuck? The is planet she? bitch. The, the planet played, bitch. She played tennis. Neptune. Right? Neptune Williams. What the Neptune fuck is fucking Mercury? Mercury Williams. Thank Uranus you. Williams. Something. <laughs> I don't fucking know. Saturn. I think was her name. <laughs> Saturn. Yeah, she was good at pet tennis at one point when she was in high school. I think. Right. She could have been something. Oh, man. All right. Well, Jeff's going to sleep. Yeah. Jeff That's fucking, our cue to wrap it Jeff up. Jeff fucking eyes closed. All right, that's gonna be fucking it for us, guys. Uh, Thank you for coming on, Jeff. Uh, check, go check him out at Hood uh, Pandas. Show. Yeah, if you if you are listening to this on Wednesday when it comes out, Listen. this Saturday there's mm-hmm. a fucking Hood Panda show. Where's it at? Uh, Caddy's Delight. Caddy's golf. Delight. Caddy's Virtual Delight golf. starts at seven. Oh, that's not far from here, actually. No, it's not. Um, yeah, Caddy's Delight Virtual Golf in Grandview. Do not listen to white women. They'll lie to you. All right. Why couldn't you have said that earlier? We could have talked about it. Wait, what's, what are you talking about? This white woman I know. She lied to me. About what? About my father. Your mom. What? <laughs> <laughs> so you talking about your mom? You talking about Louis Anderson? <laughs> <laughs> don't, don't call my mom Louis Anderson. I came up with that joke. It's so fucking funny. Tell you, you don't get to make that it's joke. It's so fucking funny. I know funny, it's funny. <laughs> Jeffrey. I'm the one father. who came up with it. You can't do that. Jeffrey, I take a scene. <laughs> That's Jeffrey. not. Jeffrey! He's not your father, Jeffrey. He's not your real father. I'm telling you pain. Is it bad that my mom looks like Louie She looks exactly like Louie Literally, as soon as you t- told me that, I thought of baskets right you away. Your dad was desperate for a fucking piece. <laughs> Hold on, man. That's fucking... You just told me to be nice to him 30 minutes ago. And now we're breaking down his existence to just a green card? You're a fucking green card, baby, dude. That green card so goddamn bad. <laughs> <laughs> he, ain't, he ain't never seen no freckly titties like them. Since he's African, he kept calling her Ooh. Lois instead of Louis. He's like, Lois, you are the most beautiful woman Debbie, I've ever met. Jeffrey, I'm an illegal. I had to make sacrifices. <laughs> you are the funniest woman I've ever met, Louis. <laughs> I want to you, mar- marry me. I just met you. Marry me. He goes, Jeffrey, you I have about to marry, to marry the woman from Family Feud. <laughs> <laughs> you have to marry me. You think he went back into his family? He's rich. He's like, I marry you. <laughs> it turns out it was just a fat woman from Wisconsin. <laughs> But I got the green card. <laughs> <laughs> this so we, is the American dream, Jeffrey. Jeffrey. <laughs> Family food, green card. Eh, not that bad. <laughs> Jeffrey, I fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> At least I might have good successful sons. You remember, you oh remember the worker in, at McDougal's in Coming to America? That is my new wife, Jeffrey. <laughs> Jeffrey, we got married she, at McDougal's. It is, it, is, when, it is my story. I came to America. I married this woman. She makes big mix. <laughs> the best big mix. And one day she's going to be off the fries. And she'll be a manager. And oh coming to America 2 is coming out soon. 
<laughs> Jeffrey, I love stirring her strawberry uh, shake. What? what is you know what? Hey, no, we're going to combine this. It's going to be Roots 2, Coming Back to America. <laughs> it's gonna, no, it's, it's going to be called Roots 2, Electric Boogaloo. <laughs> <laughs> Electric <laughs> slaves break dancing. <laughs> oh, dude, Instead dude, of Mandingo dude, fights, dude, 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 so don't fucking come for me, all right? <laughs> These no niggas are white. They're the whitest <laughs> things I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> whitest niggas I've ever oh. seen in my life. Kunta Pop and Locks Kente. <laughs> Kunta Pop, Lock and Drop It. Pop, Lock oh and Drop It. Kente. Oh, I gotta close the show on something funny. That's fucking oh, great. Okay. That's fucking great. Roots 2, Electric Boogaloo. Oh, okay. That's Roots a skit. 2, Electric Boogaloo. <laughs> Roots 2, <laughs> <laughs> it just doesn't make sense. What would the music be? <laughs> it, it, no matter what, it's definitely got steel drums. It's got steel drums. That's why it's Beverly Hills Cop. You can still break dance to it. It's Beverly Hills Cop. Boom, boop, 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 That's boop, right. Boop, uh, boop, boop, I'm boop. sleeping in the big house. Okay. <laughs> ah. You get him, boys. Ah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> oh, you. Roots to Electric Boogaloo. And then they could do You Got Served Freedom. <laughs> <laughs> That's what, like, uh, what? And they would make them dance to Go break to their bed, spirit. It's, a, it's actually where the term break dancing came from. It was originally break their spirit dancing. But... Break their spirit <laughs> dancing? <laughs> Oh my God, that's the funniest <laughs> shit. We gotta write. We gotta get in the studio and write this down. This I can't wait to see slaves doing windmills while getting whipped by a white man in the background with a beard with your Why face. Why do you say you can't wait to see that? That's a weird way to say. That. Oh, because I can't wait. I can't because wait to see if my, we could get this my shot, brothers getting. Well, because it's not real. Self-hating black man. <laughs> no, I just find humor. Humor. I find humor and funny shit that oh, it could be bad. Shit. Roots right. too. Electric. When I pick a cotton, I get to rocking. That <laughs> could be. Ba ba ba. Popping, locking, picking cotton. Uh ah uh, ba. Oh, uh, instead of like what was the dance? They used to do the body uh, shock. Yeah. So it's the cotton shock. Uh. The cotton shock or the I don't know. Okay. Ooh. Ah yeah. Uh. When I'm picking cotton and I don't know. I just feel this rhythm. <laughs> I don't know. But Master has a lot to Listen, gain. listen. This is going to continue to go in a really bad direction. I feel like we should just wrap it up here. For you, because you can't say what you want to say right now. And I know it hurts you. Because I'm going to be really it. funny once this microphone is Maybe you shouldn't off. do a video version and just do straight up audio. Maybe I shouldn't. Because you can say what you want. Maybe buddy. I just need us. like fucking he Avengers us. level special effects so I can pretend that I'm a black man. Yeah, he needs us so he can say that. Anyway. You, there's a filter for blackface. <laughs> Me and my Nick. We are Nick. Oh my god. He Steve Harvey it. is still judging it. He can still be the judge like he was when you got served. <laughs> All right, Nick. All right, let's wrap it up, man. That That's, yeah. that's it. All right. You uh, guys, uh, we're about to go jog. You guys have a phenomenal let's night. Let's go jog. Not to scare you, Jeff. It means Fuck something it. else. <laughs> He's definitely more down for the alternative meeting. All right. Thank you for tuning in, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go fucking jog. Let's go jog. Rest in peace to Betty.